I made a fake one. The brand also will celebrate its 30th anniversary next year in 2023. We have a third season of Dino Fury, which will be called Power Rangers Cosmic Fury. And we also have a special that will reunite some of the original cast members and legacy characters of Power Rangers again to celebrate the 30th anniversary. Production is underway now in New Zealand. The special and the series will be releasing uh, next year in 2023. Are the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers returning in Power Rangers Cosmic Fury or is it going to be a completely separate project? That's what we're going to be talking about today. First, we got to shout out the legend himself, Ranger Goat Jin Saku. This guy be coming up with so many crazy, I don't know if they're fan theories, leaks. This dude is a wizard, okay? Always be watching this guy. Jin does a great job covering Power Rangers. Now, yesterday was the Hasbro Investor Conference. It was super cool. It's like three hours long, and you guys don't really want to sit there and watch this, but I did. But shout out Jin for kind of letting us know it was out there and there was stuff to look for. There are some clips, as you guys probably saw. It is a fun time to be a Power Rangers fan, and they mention a special. Now, does the special have something to do with Cosmic Fury, or is it completely separate? Is it just something to do with the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers? Now, the way that they said this, it makes me think that it could be a project that is kind of like a special, but you could have the Dino Fury, Cosmic Fury gang in there. They could come and team up. What do you guys think? Could there be two separate projects? Because how sweet would that be? If there was some Cosmic Fury action, and then there's a completely other separate special. Hmm, very interesting. What are your guys' thoughts? They're filming in New Zealand, guys. They are filming in New Zealand, guys. Anything can happen at this point. We have the Mighty Morphin team in New Zealand. We have Charlie Kirsch is in New Zealand. We have the Dino Fury, AKA the Cosmic Fury team is in New Zealand. You don't think that they're gonna be filming anything together? It's very interesting. What are your guys' thoughts? We don't know much. And I really got to shout out Jim because he be coming with some crazy stuff. Now, I don't know if this anniversary special is going to be completely separate where Di the, the Dino Fury or Cosmic Fury cast will be in it or won't. It's interesting to think about that because I could make arguments for both sides. It is a little weird that they're both filming at the same time. Huh. Interesting. Could they be filming two separate projects, but they'll link at some point? Huh. I don't know. I'm just excited to be a Power Rangers fan. And this is the stuff that's kind of fun where we can come up with fan theories all the time and talk about it. It's interesting. This is some good stuff, man. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this show. For all of the OG supporters that have been watching since the beginning, thank you. You mean the world to me. And anybody that's new, you just started watching, yo, thank you too. These are my everyday adventures about Power Rangers and more. I really appreciate it. This is not a fan base. This is a family. If you can become a member, there are some super cool perks. You can get video shout outs at the end of the video if you're a gold ranger it's a great time man i love you guys this is a fun time to be a power rangers fan and we don't know everything that's happening except the stuff that they want us to know yes we know that zach's back billy's back and there's talks and confirmation from the illuminati that steve cardenas is back rocky and cat they're back too so we're gonna have some mighty morphin action happening doesn't sound like we have a yellow ranger so does that mean trini's daughter is gonna be stepping in is that a completely separate project and if it is does it link with cosmic fury at all it's interesting 
And if the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers have nothing to do with Cosmic Fury, what other Rangers are coming back? Are we getting an in-space team-up? Bro, I could talk about this all day. It's a great time to be a fan. I say this probably every video these days, and I never used to. I'm just super geeked about this brand, and if you're not... I really can't make anybody feel any type of way. Some people don't like Power Rangers, but if you've been a Power Ranger fan through thick and thin, through the dark days, and you don't like this, man, I don't know what to tell you. They're at least trying. You're not always going to be perfect. Someone told me this years ago when I was about 16, 17, trying to do my first rap concerts and stuff like that, putting together, you know, a whole showcase. And someone told me, yo, I don't care if nobody shows up. Did you go and put the work in, all right? Sometimes things are bad. Sometimes the numbers don't show up. Sometimes things happen. But did you put the work in to make it good? Were you ready? Did you do the advertisements? Were you there walking everywhere, hanging up flyers on social media every day for 30 days, pushing it? Did you try? And that's what Power Rangers is doing. They're actually trying. That's all I ever wanted from this brand for a while towards the end of the Saban era, the, the Neo Saban, I should say. You could see that they were giving up. It was very weird on how this all happened and I, I didn't like it. And maybe if they weren't giving up, they didn't know what was going on around them then. It, it was very bad. It's almost like an old manager or sports coach that was in their prime, but, or, you know, a player that was in their prime, but now they're old and you hit that point where you're 30, 40, you can't play the game like you used to. That's how I felt like Saban was. He was stuck in his ways. The game was changing. The action game was immensely changing with all these big brands coming up like Marvel turning into a juggernaut in front of Power Rangers eyes. Well, Power Rangers just went deeper and deeper and deeper down. Marvel was rising and you guys got to remember Power Rangers in the 90s was making way more money and was bigger than Marvel at point. But for a short period of time, Power Rangers was kicking some butt on all levels, man. You can't deny that. Now, through the years, it's been a roller coaster with Power Rangers. It's gone up, it's gone down, it's gone up. But with quality, lately, Power Rangers has been killing it. I'm excited to see what's about to happen. Is this going to be a separate Mighty Morphin Power Rangers special? Is it going to have anything to do with Cosmic Fury at all? And if not, will Cosmic Fury have some past Rangers come back? And will those Rangers make more sense to the storyline? Like some In Space, some Lost Galaxy. Could Billy make an appearance in Cosmic Fury, but not the rest of the Rangers? Very interesting. Like some I scratch your back, you scratch my back. Let me know what you guys think. I'm always here to listen to the fans with news kind of going crazy right now. I've been making a lot of videos about the news, but once we get things slowing down, you know the fan theories will be coming out. So keep making those insane fan theories. We'll be putting some together soon. We love you guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Peace. I want to give a big shout out to Gold Ranger member Dead Echo X-Ray. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this content, you know what to do. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. You can also become a member. Please join the fan club support team right now. We have a Blue Ranger power up and a Gold Ranger power up. This is an awesome way to talk with the fans. Join a fan club official chat group. You can also be featured in our videos. At the end of the videos, I will shout you out. That's if you get the Gold Ranger Power Up membership. Go check it out. Go support the fan club. We love you guys, and thanks for watching. Peace.